What's going on guys? Ryan Nose Tech here with TechInform.us. We've got a pretty exciting unboxing today of the iPhone 4S. This is 32 gigabytes. We'll see the color when I get it open. I know when I ordered when I pre-ordered this last Friday, uh, it was actually um, really busy. We had a lot of problems with the pre-orders and the color uh, was pretty controversial between chat and Skype and Ustream. So, made a decision. See how we like it. Cut the tape on this. This thing just showed up a minute ago. Here's the box. Don't know if that gives the color right away right away, but here it is next to the iPhone 4 box. It's pretty much the same. You already know I got the white one. Just figured I'd do something different there. Looks like the exact same image here. I've got 7 as the date. I uh, wonder if that has anything to do with the day that it was uh, talked about on the 7th. Uh, same stuff here. 32 gigs. Um, doesn't really feel any different. It's, of course, heavier with all the stuff inside. But uh, we'll go ahead and crack this open now. A little bit of shrink wrap as usual. See if I can not cut myself. Take this off. Um, the side of the box is different. Obviously we've got a, an S there now signifying that uh, it is actually a different device. I'm sure the numbers on the back would do that too. Got that on both sides. We'll take the cover off and there it is. All beautiful as usual. Beautiful Apple product. And the first thing we're gonna see over here is the differences in the antenna. We've got the same one at the bottom. The one uh, iPhone 4S uh, below, see the volume buttons are the same. Uh, the hold switch has moved down. We've got an antenna there and it's been removed from the top iPhone 4 here. So they got rid of the top on that. And then the side, um, we now have an antenna here. So it's more like the CDMA version of the iPhone 4 and uh, less like the GSM iPhone 4. Uh, so we might as well just take this off. It's going to get fingerprints on it. That was, I think that's different. We had one piece of plastic over the top like that and one more there on the bottom. And that really does look beautiful and white. I've always had black black phones and black iPods. Uh, so I thought I'd try something different. Uh, the camera doesn't look any different, but we all know that it is. I'll have another video on camera picture and video tests later on. We'll push that over here and uh, see what else is in the box. I think we already know. Looks like the same thing. We're going to pull up on that tab, take this off. Designed by Apple in California. This is where we're going to find our fingertips. Apple stickers. Here we are. Fingertips. Just a little guide how to use iOS, iPhone 4S, important product information guide none of us will read, and uh, some more Apple stickers to put to the collection. Also in the box, we have two things I never use. This being one of them. And the other one being uh, the Apple headphones. I use the Bose ones that have the same little uh, thing built in. They are better quality than I think they used to be, but they're still cheap material and they just don't have the base that the Bose ones do naturally. As well as a new sync cable, actually something I needed. My old one was getting worn uh, right about there. So, new sync cable, um, everything else we expected. That is the unboxing of the 4S. It actually feels lighter. I don't know why. I don't know why it would feel lighter, but it, it does. Um, uh, don't know what to expect. Actually, this will be iOS 5, so it'll just boot right up and uh, want me to set it up as a new device from here, but I'm just going to plug it into iTunes. will not be restoring from a backup. I am going to set this up as new, but uh, probably more through iTunes than on this device itself. Thanks for watching the unboxing, guys. The iPhone 4S. I'm very excited. I have a lot of different videos to come with the camera, and we'll do some speed tests. We all know this has the better camera. Uh, Siri, which is really cool. I'll make a video on that probably later today, uh, as well as um, the A5 Dual Core, which uh, I think it's going to be great, the 7 times graphics performance, it's the same RAM, but it's two, uh, It's pretty much two processors, 800 megahertz chips, whether they're underclocked from a gigahertz to 800 megahertz. And as I said, there is the uh, setup screen. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, check out our website, techinform.us, and my Twitter is twitter.com slash jamesrschultz, those links are down below. Thanks for watching, again, have a great weekend, I'll talk to you guys next week or in a later video today. One more thing. There's iCloud. Forgot to mention that. Bottom of the box, iCloud, cool service. Okay, bye.